Welcome to the Running Network Show. Join us each time as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great sport. It's going to be a beautiful day here in Central Park. Like I said, five, 6,000 women at least running in this race today. The women are headed to the start out on Central Park West. So we went to the archives. We went to the race results. Who won the first ever New York Committee? A 17 year old from the West Coast. She has not been back in 40 years. Please, a warm women's New York City welcome for Jacqueline Dixon. <laughs> here, start in front of the Trump International Hotel. Here's, here's all the top women here. down the Central Park West as they head to the north end of the island here in Manhattan. It's like the number one uh, marathon in the world. Yeah. Here's Edna Kiplagat way ahead of the field. Cool. Yeah. There's our second place finisher. There's all our top finishers. Our top American, Stephanie Stuff. Okay, here comes Desi, the Hansons, Rochester, Michigan. Come on, Desi, come on in. 
with a 33-37 clocking. There she is. Fine race by Desi. And then your thoughts about today's race, um, your victory, um, just just your thoughts of uh, today's race. Today's race was a great one. This is a great experience standing with uh, uh, 8,000 women and uh, I'm happy to be a winner. Last year uh, it was a little bit hard because uh, I, I had not done uh, a lot of training but this year I tried to improve so I'm, I'm feeling up about the results. Desi DeVille here. So anyway, she ran the mini uh, 10K here in New York this morning. So how would you feel about today's race? It was good. I mean, we're in tough training right now, and so to come in and uh, just get in the race situation and run hard was good. You know, go back and get back to work. So. How would you like running with all your competitors from overseas, special lot to the Africans? Yeah, it's um, always great to see them, and you actually get to know a few of the athletes on the road at different places, so it's fun. I, I get along with them, and it's nice to line up with them. Um, I don't read too much into results today. 10K is pretty far removed from the marathon, and uh, everyone's in different stages in training, so... And uh, well, I see Adney Kip Kiplagod seems she can run from, uh, what, a mile up to a marathon. She's amazing. Yeah, she's talented. She's um, certainly someone who has a shot, a great shot at the gold, uh, definitely a medal. So she's certainly someone to keep an eye on. How's your training been going? Really well. We're just ramping up right now. Uh, first, you know, we get marathon pace stuff and getting into it right now. So. Have you been here all week doing some things? Yes, I got in on Tuesday, so I've been pretty busy. Now, are you going out to the uh, trials out in Eugene for a few days or not? I'll be out there for two days doing processing, and that'll be about it. Okay. Well, hey, congratulations, and we will uh, see you uh, definitely in London. All right. Thank you. Yep.